What is a DSN? This is Dan. Dan is a consultant and has to install CISPR at a customer. First, Dan completes the server installation in a central location, which all client machines need to access. The customer manages their data using SQL Server. The CISPR server installation needs to be configured to connect to the MS SQL database. In other words, Dan needs to tell CISPRO where the database is. If his installation of CISPRO cannot connect to the MS SQL database, then the customer will be unable to work. Dan needs a data source name, DSN, to tell him where the data is. A DSN is defined in ODBC so that it can find the location of the data. ODBC is an interface standard for accessing data and communicating with database systems, irrespective of the operating or database system or programming language. This is done using ODBC drivers. These drivers are a bridge between applications, in this case CISPRO, and database systems, in this case SQL Server. However, simply having a driver does not tell CISPRO where the MS SQL database is, it is just a connector. The data source name is therefore very important as it is defined in ODBC and provides the location of the data. So let's recap. CISPRO needs to know where the MS SQL database is. It uses a DSN to do this, which is stored on the server using a driver called ODBC. If Dan does not set this up correctly, CISPRO will not be able to work. So Dan creates the DSN in ODBC and sets up the location of the MS SQL database. Dan's client can now start working in CISPRO.